So after two days of getting Windows Insider Preview installed on my machine, um, I finally have Windows 10 Home Insider Preview. Uh, the reason I need this is because the Windows Mixed Reality headset requires Insider Preview builds. Um, in fact, it requires Windows 10 Creator uh, also, at least according to some of the documentation. So after spending about two days of hosing my Windows installation on this laptop, reinstalling, uninstalling, and then reinstalling again, I finally have build 16232. And I've just connected the Windows Mixed Reality headset, the, the HDMI, as well as the USB, and it looks like it got detected. So now we have, welcome to Windows Mixed Reality. So I'm going to hit start, or get started. So it's going to check things, requirements, installations. Yes, yes, yes. I agree. OK, so obviously my hardware is OK. I have a 1070 GTX, an i7 CPU, 16 gigs of RAM. Uh, disk space. I really wish it would not install it onto the C drive, but let's see. Next. Yes, yes, I just wish there was more documentation for this. Uh, okay, there's an audio jack. Yay! So it doesn't include, you know, headphones, um, very much like the Vive. Uh, whereas the Rift includes headphones on the headset itself. So as you can see, there's an adjustment headband, an HDMI, as well as a three, uh, USB 3.0 connector, or I should say headband adjustment. Um, I don't have any controllers. I don't think the controllers are going to be available for some time. Yes. Wonderful. Details about controllers that are not available. Even more details. We will use a gamepad or mouse instead. Um, yes. So that was room size as opposed to the seated experience. Let's create a boundary. Yes, create a boundary. Okay. Uh, need five by seven. Next, we will center your headset, hold it in front of you and point it towards the computer and then select center. Okay, so here we go. I'm holding the headset, pointing it towards the computer and center. Okay, now trace your boundary. You need five by seven. Stand up and point your headset towards your computer. Then select trace. Walk around the perimeter of your space. Keep the headset pointed at your computer. Oh, okay. I guess this is inside out tracking, so it has to be pointed at the computer. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. Uh, we shuffle my work area a little bit. All right, let's start the trace. It's like trace, tracking, 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 tracking. Tracking, 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 tracking. Okay. This way, move stuff around a little bit more. Move my sit down. And then come this way, this way. Still pointing at it, still pointing at it, and. Well, let me try one more time. 
So I center it, I hit trace, and then I do this. Back up a little bit. That cable is getting tangled. Okay, uh, not ideal, but let's go. Mixed reality is better with speech. Uh, turn on, sure, speech recognition, yay. What? Try again. Okay, learn more. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, why can't I download it? I couldn't download. Well, what the hell am I supposed to do with that? Arr. Okay, yes, 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 oh yes, try the virtual agent. Okay, virtual agent, wow me with your prowess. download the Windows Mixed Reality software. <laughs> download the Windows Mixed Reality software. Windows Mixed Reality software. Oh. Immersive headset support. My network is connection. My network connection is fine because I can obviously connect to this page. I'm pretty sure I have more than two gigs. Try again. Try again. Okay, well, um, <laughs> I guess this is as far as I go.